Good morning. My name is Dr. Prashant. I am the director of medical services here at MedLife. And today we'll be talking about coronavirus, which is the most talked about virus right now. The WHO has recently increased the threat level, the global threat level of coronavirus to high. And let's talk about why is it a high threat globally. Let's understand a little bit more about coronavirus. Coronavirus is a family of viruses which in the past have caused diseases like common cold and flu. They, the infection caused by coronavirus is usually limited to the upper respiratory tract which involves throat, sinuses and nose. Now there have been a few variants of coronavirus which have caused severe infections in the past like SARS, like MERS and now this Wuhan uh, variant of virus which has come up in China. Now this variant, why is it serious? In China, this variant has caused infection in 2741 individuals. This infection has been confirmed and another 5800 are suspected. And this information is recent information by WHO. Outside China, it has spread in 37 individuals and in 11 countries. Now, what was the common link? All these individuals who had infection came from China or had a history of travel to China. And India is not one of those countries, fortunately till now. The infection by this Wuhan variant of coronavirus usually starts as an upper respiratory tract infection and presents just like a normal common cold. Just by symptoms, really a person cannot differentiate whether it's just a common cold virus or it's that severely infected strain of coronavirus. The problem with this particular strain of coronavirus is that it is highly infectious and it causes a much more severe disease, which means it spreads quickly from the upper respiratory tract to the lower respiratory tract and causes lung infection like pneumonia. And as a result, people die very quickly if they are infected from this virus. People who are specially immunocompromised or are suffering from a chronic disease are more prone for a severe form of this illness. Now the question in everybody's mind is whether you should be really worried about getting infected from this coronavirus strain. Now as I mentioned previously, unfortunately no virus cases have been reported till now in India, no confirmed cases. And uh, you should be worried if you hear somebody getting infected with coronavirus in your vicinity. There are few things that can be done to prevent the spread of the infection. And these guidelines have been laid down by CDC and WHO. First, you should make sure that you do not come in contact with somebody who is suffering from an upper respiratory tract infection like a common cold or flu. Second, you have to make sure that you frequently wash your hands, especially after coming in contact with a sick person. Third, you should always make sure that you have your hands washed before you touch your eyes, nose or mouth. And fourth, if you yourself have upper respiratory tract infection, Always make sure that you follow the usual cuff etiquette in public or in private and avoid going out in public places. Okay, regarding this coronavirus infection, prevention is better than cure because there is no cure available for coronavirus as of now. There are no vaccines, there are no drugs which specifically attack this virus. So take all the preventive measures that I've just told you and if you think you have contracted this infection or if you have any doubt or suspicion please connect with your doctor right knowledge is right health subscribe to our channel for more such informative videos